This here's Clint. And this is Jim Bob. We are the Whiskey Drink. That's right. And we're back with another review for you. Well, let's get to it. Oh yeah. Super slow mo. Ready? Yep. <laughs> Right there, we got uh, um, you know, some stuff. Um, Great American Blueberry is what we got right there. It's 28 proof. It's 14 percent alcohol by volume. Is Greater Great American the company? I guess. Yeah. No, oh, mate. All right. Uh, it's flavored malt beverage specialty, uh, made with natural or artificial flavor and certified coloring. A certified color. Now, what in the hell is certified color? Well, that's like, uh, you know, Mountain Dew, they said, uh, don't use that, don't drink that yellow number five because it'll make your pecker small. Did you ever hear that? Yeah. That's, oh, well, that's, yeah, it's just yeah. scientists and chemicals. And so I was confused. I thought you were going to start with, uh, don't, don't you eat that yellow snow? Oh, well, no. Then no. you went to yellow number five. Well, it confused me right away. Tell them what the special, uh, the special thing about this is, not only being blueberry, but what's the special thing about this moonshine right here? The most special, it's not moonshine, it's malt. Oh, malt. Hey, anyway, the most special part is, I picked this up at Sansu's. Now, not the Hummer City store, I was in the Blairsville store. But still, we but love Sansu's. Um, walked in, grabbed myself a couple slices of pie. Pie is slang for pizza. I learned that on the street. That's right. And, uh, I saw this little display over there. They had this and they had the strawberry. And uh, I asked the guy, I said, how is that stuff over there? He goes, well, there was 100 bottles on that display. And there was like 15 when I was there. Wow. So, And that display was only up for like two days. So apparently people like this stuff. Yeah, so what's the special thing about it, though? It's five bucks. Oh, it's five bucks. But why is it five bucks? What's going to be the, the people where everybody's going to be out there gonna, just going to go, boo! Because it's only 14%. It's only 14%. Yeah, I said that earlier, Jim. Oh, that 28 shit. proof. Oh, never mind. Blue. <laughs> shit, I wasn't paying attention. But it's definitely blue. It is blue. So, Like a Smurfs spit. You know what it kind of reminds me of? Well, um, yeah, okay, not really. It'd be it more brown. It would be a little brown. Um, it's gluten-free. Oh, man, wow. Gluten-free for all you gluten-free People. Well, that's good as gluten free because if it wasn't, we wouldn't be drinking it. Okay, now here's an interesting thing here. Now, this is alcohol and it says contains no wheat, barley, rye, or oats. Wow, you know why? Because they're making it with the malts. I think, you know what I mean? No, but okay. Malt. Sounds good. Um, this is that you can, they have a website. We'll check it out www.drinkgreatamerica.com. Oh, yeah. This is a product of the USA. Drink or think and drink responsibly. If I'm drinking, well, I ain't thinking too much. Yeah, true. And I don't think very responsibly. Probably not. Brewed and bottled by Stout Brewing Company. Well, I like Stouts. Kings Mountain, North Carolina. Well, sounds all right to me. Yeah, it's relatively close. I've been down there one time. It's cool. Now I am happy to put this little thing right here on it. They probably can't see. I'll show you. Contains Says, alcohol. They put it right on the damn. Just bottle. so you don't think it's a juicy juice. Yeah. Um. Now. I'm curious if this company, uh, maybe we'll have to do some research after this video, but uh, I'm curious if this company has higher percentages and if they have different flavors. I don't know. Nope, you want to open her up? Oh, I will. Oh, man. I'm going to crack the seal up. All right, this is the old school style of having the uh, little thing right there. Well, well I mean. All right, well, well here's the pop really test. Pop here's test. the pop test. Eh. It sounds like a bottle eh. coming off. Yeah, I mean. Wow, that smells ooh, delicious on the wow. cat. Wow, that, that smells good. Hmm. Hmm. Oh man, this is like Kool Aid. Yeah, it does kind of remind you of Kool Aid. It, it, it does remind me of one of those fruit yeah. drinks. Yeah, it reminds me of the the uh, ice cream fruit bar thingies. It does. You know yeah, about? the ices, ices. Ices. And it also reminds me of those little uh, drinks you get in the barrels, the barrel drinks. Juices. Yeah, the huggies. Hug hugs. Hug when you get a yeah. huggy. And you, uh, it's a blue one. Yeah. Wow, that's pretty good. I'm excited. All right. Well, pour them up, Jim. Oh man. You, you're the guest of all. Well, you're the, uh, the. I know, but artist. Well, you're but the you artist guy. Learn. You need What's to learn. What's green plus blue? Um, make brownish. Go oh. down. 
Uh, makes teal. Makes teal. There you guys go. Makes teal. We're teaching you along with the... Actually, uh, in the light, it's got a really nice emerald green look there to you it, Louie. Oh, I was just making sure Louie wasn't getting into it. See that in the light? It has a real nice emerald. Oh, it does. It's pretty. That is pretty. Well, all right. Well, cheers. Down the hatch. Cheers. Smooth as ice. Yeah. Yeah. It, it, it tastes like a uh, malt it's, beverage. Yeah. That makes sense. You know, mixed with a hug. Lovely, yeah. But juicy. You know what this... It kind of has the taste of uh, Four Locos. Yeah. How, they, how they're flavored malt. It's the same thing. But I, I don't like the fact that they're putting it in a moonshine bottle. That's the thing that confuses me. Well, it's a marketing thing. It is a marketing thing, and that's, you know, so if you guys see this, this isn't moonshine, this is malt beverage, Yeah. but it's only five bucks. If you drink the whole damn thing, it'll probably get you drunk. Oh, it'll probably get you there. Yeah. Um, flavor notes. Um, yeah, I can taste a little blueberry. Yeah, I do it's taste got an blueberry. artificial blueberry flavor to it. Yeah, not a real blueberry flavor. Um, <clears throat> you can't really taste the alcohol at all. No. So it's a girly drink. It's got the, like I said, it's got a little note of that malt. Yeah, yeah. Like in the malt drinks. Like a 45, like a Colt 45. Well, yeah, kind of like that, but more like a Four Locos. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Mm. The the flavor leaves you real quick. Yeah. Once you take your initial drink, that That's flavor true. is about gone. That's yeah. true. Not, not not any flavor that you can savor. No. By any means. Nothing to flavor savor in there. Hmm. It's all right. Yeah, I mean. I mean, five bucks, I'd, you know, I'd get that. Hell yeah. Okay. Now I want to go pick up the strawberry one. Oh, the strawberry There's one. A strawberry one. Oh, man. Have you not been listening to anything I said? Probably not. Probably not. Well, I, that's mm. pretty delicious. Are we rating these? We were rating this. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I, you know, do we rate it on a kid's drink or do we rate it on yeah, a no, no, dog no. drink? Yeah. Uh, I'm going to give it three out of five. Uh, mm -hmm. It's a little higher than I probably should. Yeah. But it's a nice, light drink. If uh, you're cutting your grass, it'd, it'd be a thirst quencher. Yeah. It's like the Gatorade of the alcohol world, if you yeah. want. It's yeah. a, it takes you back to drinking those Huggies yeah. and uh, eating the Massey Pops. Yeah, like when you were in high school. You know, everybody piled into a car and you went and drank Huggies. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, I, I mean, I, good three. I want to go higher, but this is a, based on whiskey. I don't really consider this whiskey, so I'm going to give it a three because it's a... Uh, Low alcohol percentage, but it does have the awesome flavor of a kid's. It, it's nostalgic. Yeah. Brings yeah. you back to being a little kid. You know what it's missing? It's missing the plastic flavor. That's very true. That's what it's missing. Maybe they need to put this. That's another thing. You know what? I give them a two. I'm sorry to take it back, but I give them a two because they're, mis, uh, what's that called? Misleading. Misleading people with this fucking bottle right here. Put it in plastic little sense. huggy bottles that say four dollars. There you go. Yeah. Huggy malt bottles. You know, I should be on marketing. Be on somebody's marketing team, but yeah. nobody hires me. Well, let's go email them and tell them. That's a great let's idea. Do let's do it. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. All right. Hey guys, make sure you guys go and check out the Patreon channel. That's right, because over there is some shit that you're not going to be able to see on a regular channel. You know, we got some like behind the scenes and just crazy shit. Interesting stories about the videos themselves. So make sure you check that shit out. Hey, what, what do they need to do? Well, they make, make sure you need to uh, like the videos. Yeah. You need to comment on the videos. Yeah. And you, uh, what's that last one? Uh, subscribe to the channel. Oh, That's yeah. It. All right, well, All we'll right. see you later. All right.